dude tiefling. Um, since Caleb's really only seen one dude's tiefling uh, <laughs> before. <laughs> Long may he reign indeed. Holy <laughs> shit. You've only seen one dude's tiefling. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Why is just my dick purple? <laughs> <laughs> Well, it is nobler in the mind to ponder the pros and more pros of Twitch or Twitch Prime. Or to take hands and gift new subs to critters who find they can't afford them. both unique. You faced death together multiple times. You've entertained each other, created for each other, and now it's time to show that special someone just how deeply you feel for them. God damn it! This one's tough. <laughs> Through this crazy expansion, somebody just farted. Who did it? Was it you? That's the couch. That's the couch. That's, 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 that's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> this stays in the roll. Whether it's by a torpedo inducing venom. Torpa? Wait. Torpa? I think that's a typo. Like, remember to resubscribe to the Twitch Prime. Oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah. Yes! Could you maybe. I've done it without my teammates? <laughs> no! And they couldn't have done No puppet murder. No Sam Regal. Oh my god! Whoa. We have a third friend! Whoa. Whoa. Okay, okay, so it's good, good for now. Respectfully, I was uh, looking for the Prime Rib Realm, but uh, this isn't too bad. You see, if you already have access to the Prime Rib, wow, freaking shit. You've got your character all figured out. A halfling sorcerer named Dr. Dance Buffalo. You've chosen your first level spells, filled out your skills, you... Is, he in? <laughs> Is that okay if he's in? <laughs> You guys are. Okay, um, let's, let's compose ourselves for a second. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> you guys keeping up with this OJ thing? <laughs> Happy winter time! Happy winter! Happy winter time, Oh, guys. winter good time, yeah. You got a little bit of emotion. I know. He's here. Who's here? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, the money. Oh, the money. Oh, oh the money. Oh, put it in my mouth. 
put the money in my house. I want to spend the money. I want the money. Huh? What the fuck? Fuck out of here. <laughs> Great. Great.
much worse when there's no one right in front of you. Hi, Jim! Fuck! Hi, Jim! Those who dabble in divine magics, like the cleric or druid, have a wild array of spells they always have access to, and can choose which to prepare at the top of the day. More studied arcane classes, like the wizard, can only prepare spells they have scribed in their spellbook. Where once the waters rolled calmly by, where ocean's heart did sing, they stocked a lass with a hungry eye and claws that grasp and ring. With lantern lure of a glimmer pot, with treasure in her eyes, below they swam to the gold they thought would await them as the prize. It was clamoring together with the third verse. Yet each of them went to surely die, the graves to not be found. For Dashila and her hungry eye collects the lost and drowned. Come pick this what thing up! Be done. Get it away from me! Can what? I go over and try to just pick it up? I Put it on its over. back or something! How big is this turtle? Oh my god. Uh, it's yes, about, it I'd say, eight foot front to back. It's a giant. Okay. Turtle. Can we flip, flip it? it? Yeah. Can we use it? I'll help. I can help and yes. mess together. Yeah, maybe can flip, flip it, it onto its okay, back. Okay, we have to get to your turn first before we. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sorry, we're still yeah. on the ship. So, Ford, you're up. It's a dream made of everything else. Yep, it has you up against the wall, and you're like holding your shield, like, it's trying to snap and push you into the snow. If I leave, it gets an attack of opportunity. It does. What you want to do? I can't. Leave. I yeah. No. Fuck, I'm gonna stand there. I've been talking. <laughs> 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 For the record, when I said giant tortoise, I imagined the big turtle I swam with in Hawaii. It was so nice. I did it in an eight foot. <laughs> the Stay Puff Marshmallow <laughs> Man, Liam. I will. The Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. Okay. Well, <laughs> choose the form of your destroyer. That's, that's true. That's what. That's exactly what it is.
Wait, 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 wait. wait. Okay. Wait. That's gonna get your face. That's going right into uh, the door. Missed all together. <laughs> Interesting. Oh man, you almost hurt. You almost hurt Molly. Oh wait. Hey, not Brian? too soon. Too soon. Oh, wait, Molly's. Hmm. Well, thank you, Marsha. Molly. Molly. stuff because you're so disorganized <laughs> click open a web page <laughs> you heard about a critical role that's good and now you're ready to kick some butt hey. in a mind shaft full of no, no. there it is it's D and D D and D beyond that's good that's it's good D&D. <laughs> you got your snaps you got your swords you got your stuff <laughs> and you got your invisible wall it's D and D. D and D. D and D beyond. Yeah, actually, it was I, a pitch I perfect know, performance.
Yes! Yeah! No matter where you are.
For instance, look at my face. Looks normal now, right? But when we add high-tech CGI effects, oh, I look like a beholder! Roar! Anti-magic cone, D&D Beyond! Okay, reset. Now check out, uh, check out this awesome face swapping feature. Okay, right now I look like Sam Regal, but now, boop! Oh, I'm Matt Mercer. Welcome to Critical Role. Allison, you got your critical role in my Pillars of Eternity. You broke my fucking nose! This is going great. It's going out, guys. We're getting it. Slowly but surely. This won't be a the cast of Critical Role, practicing their proper British etiquette for their first trip to London. Ah, there we go. Oh, Pinky's up now. Masterful. Critical Role 
Who's coming to MC in London? Hands. Until they're all disappeared into but, the well, shadow. Holy hands! <laughs> but you're holding Nott's hand? You going with him? No, rule before is, we came in here was Everybody hold hands. Everybody hold hands. So Nott, you're being dragged into its mouth. Or you can stay <laughs> out. Hello. Stay out. Uh, I've already died once, it's okay, let's go. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Now you two can have the power of the Storm Lord. Break those chains because you have permission to rage. Extreme. Eat a baby. Sorry, Grandma. Holy shit. I can't believe I'm finally going to be an action figure that I get to design myself. My plan is so much closer. What now? Oh. Turns around, and you can now see its other arm is the same, and there is a third arm coming out of it, out of its stomach that also comes to this point, and it kind of looks to you all and kind of. No. Gives this like low, mournful, what the fuck? just wail. Uh -huh. oh. <laughs> To recap, 
We've learned about an age-old prophecy. The one who can walk between realms, an almighty being that charges all 12 game souls. Wait, but if Travis is the chosen one, what does that make me? A liability. <laughs> we need to get you boys out of this game realm, but not before you charge up the game soul. We need to get these game souls charged before Bastilar splices again. Oh, we've traveled from realm to realm. The game ranch. Fantasy ranch. Neo game ranch. Jungle ranch. Water ranch. Spooky ranch. Cool ranch. Prehistoric ranch. Met dozens of critters friends. Rootin' tootin' really. Tetanus Terry. Tientina. Flint Westwood. Draca. Noir. Kamlin the Frog. Red Burb the Pirate. Minnesota Jones. <laughs> Alfred Dingbacked. Rachel T. Rex. <laughs> Evaded a feline warlock who dabbles in black magic. I am Bastalar, <laughs> the Ascended One, destructor of the gameverse, shatterer of realms, and void pharaoh of the down lords. I knew him ages ago, a simpler time, when he was known as Mitten McFluffy Floof. When Bastalar went off the deep end, we all had to take up arms for the greater good. Bastalar has made a pact with Void Tick Industries. <laughs> they were the first megacorp to rival the power of the gods. My newest toy from Void Tech Industries, Specimen X! <laughs> and learned more about who created this fucking game verse. Long ago. No. Before the rift. Oh, God. The game verse was whole. It was a beautiful utopian world where critters and humans played games together in harmony. Ove is the twelfth and final maker. The Ove created a high council of gods to help with the creation of the game verse. Once all the work had been done, the gods became restless and spiteful and turned against Ove. The Ove created four great titans to keep the other gods at bay. Once peace came to the world, these guardians of Ove were buried deep beneath the Dymore. The Dymore is the holy plane that all critters go to when their souls have been released by the O. It's been rumored that Bastilar is searching for the DNA of these beasts and experimenting with Cyber Eldritch gene splicing with the help of Vortec Industries. Wait, wait. wait, who am I talking to? We have not killed any yet because we are oh awaiting God, reinforcements. You are wearing a lot of jewelry for someone that does not. I have jewelry. earned this. If you raise your voice one more time, we might just have to take you back with us. <laughs> you don't get to talk anymore. Uh, anybody else point us in the direction of these giants so we can help you keep your job?